Hey everyone, John Chow here from johnchow.com and welcome to another video. I figure in this video I'm going to show you my new office. Okay, let's begin with these desks. Uh, excuse Widget, he's just like sitting on the mat. Uh, these desks are by Uplift Systems and these are standing desks. These legs, they rise up and down from sitting height to standing height. I have two of them. It is made with one inch bamboo. So it's nice and solid and sturdy. It looks quite nice. Complements my wood floor. Uh, it came with, it came with this, uh, I guess, breakout bar of lift and came with a little cable organizer. So as you can see, I did a little bit of uh, cleaning up with the cable since the last time you saw this. So tidied up the cable a little bit. Still, still needs a little bit of work, but it's just, yeah, it's coming along. It's coming along. All right, so on this desk here, I have a couple of a uh, couple of notebooks. A couple of notebooks here. So starting with this one, this is uh, this is the Dell, my Windows, my Windows notebook here. Uh, I mostly I mostly work with almost exclusively on Mac products, uh, Apple products right here. But I do have a have a single Dell for Windows because I do need a, a PC. Uh, there are a few stuff. That PC has that Apple simply doesn't have. For example, uh, my accounting, my accounting software is PC only. So this has got to be the world's fastest accounting computer. <laughs> uh, Core i7, NVIDIA 1080p. It actually is every bit as powerful as this uh, late 2016 MacBook Pro that costs more than twice as much as this Dell. So yeah. So uh, basically, this notebook was my old work notebook. Uh, but I replaced it with the new 2018 MacBook right there. So this is uh, Sally's notebook now. And this is the Windows, the Windows 10 notebook that I use. My wife uses this one sometime. And you, know, you want to get a little closer look at the uplift system here. This allows me to adjust it up and down. See, now I have memory here. So memory number one, that is Sally's work height. Memory number two is Sally's sit down height. And memory number three is is this height, right, and my work height. So usually when I'm working, I have both desks elevated to my standing position. So this is the other one here. And this is uh, the main workstation. You know, sometime uh, when this is where I operate from. So we got the new 2018 MacBook Pro, the 7K MacBook. And that's, that's uh, augmented by two 5K 27 inch LG displays all right so uh, that gives me like uh, I don't know like how many megapixels of uh, how many k's of display but it's a lot it's a lot but uh, yeah sometimes a lot so I will watch a video on this screen work on this screen other stuff on this screen when I'm editing video I edit on this screen uh, stuff on here but it gives me a lot of options as I can you know I can just move the mouse from one screen to the next screen like let me see here like I fire something up here So you know, I can move it like from one screen over. It's yeah, it's typical. Yeah, cool. Yeah. All right. And four terabytes of SSD augmented by another four terabyte uh, drive there, plus another two terabyte drive there. So basically, ten terabytes plus another two terabyte plus uh, another terabyte. So. Uh, yeah, I got. I should have enough memory to last me a little while. Right, this here is my scanner, ScanSnap scanner. My office is paperless. I try to keep no paper in in this place. So when I do get any bills, it, I put it in there. It scans the document, puts it onto Evernote, and I can access it from anywhere in the world. So, like, let me see. Like, yeah, this. Evernote here. So I can, after I scan it, I can access it from Evernote. These are all my notes. Yeah, boom, like that. So that's, uh, that's my way to get paperless office. And after I scan, after I scan it, uh, my Amazon, my Amazon basics, uh, shredder. So I just shred the, uh, the documents and then, yeah, recycle the paper. Uh, this pretty cool. I mean, I had this for a while. It can't complain. It's a confetti, it's a confetti shredder. It shreds everything nice and small and 
unrecognizable. You can't, no way you can restore it. Uh, the chairs here, uh, these are Herman Miller's, Herman Miller and body chair. These are the most comfortable chairs I ever, I've ever sat on, you know, if I'm sitting. So I got one for myself, uh, one for Sally. They're, they're 15 bucks a piece. Uh, yeah, not cheap, but you know, I, you, when you sit down for extended periods of time, you want to be comfortable. And when I'm standing, and I, I'm, I got these uh, uplift floor mats that came with a desk that allows me a nice little cushion. Yeah, there's a little cushion there, so less fatigue that way. Uh, other things in the office, but this is this is the this is the main work area. But other stuff, and you got uh, the printer here, uh, another four terabyte drive, my Maverick Pro, the other song, my my Canon, my Canon. I guess this is my old blogging system, my Canon blog system with all the lenses, additional lenses, the uh, A7R, A7 three. A7 III camera, the camera I'm filming on this right now. Additional lenses for the A7, uh, charger, fidget spinners. Right here we got a GoPro, which I hardly use anymore. Light of ice. And more the lens I'm using to film this video right now. More stuff up there. Uh, I think that's uh, virtual reality glasses. Yeah, but some, and just, just some books and stuff. Yeah, books, lots of books. I still got a lot of copy of my, of my, of my book, blogging with, uh, blogging with John Chow and Blogging Secrets. So, yeah, so basically, and oh yeah, and uh, this is the router. This is, uh, yeah, it's, uh, it's, it's a specialized gaming router, but it's, it's re apparently it can go through, it can cover almost the whole house, but not really. But so I'll show you how I, how I extend the router, but this is the, uh, my little, I guess uh, the Alexa kind of thing. Uh, I won this at an affiliate summit, so I haven't really set it up correctly or anything like that. But it, I use it just to play play music. And there's my voice over IP phone. But yeah, this router allows me to almost send for the house, but some parts of it, on one way in the house, it doesn't reach, so here's what I do. So let me show that to you. I have these, I have these range extender. Oh, and, and here's the other, the other, the other office chair I got. This is the new, uh, a Talamos office chair. It's uh, less expensive than the, way less expensive than those uh, Herman Miller. It's like five times less expensive and nearly as comfortable. Yeah. All right, and this stuff is, it came back from China. My my wife and Sally just came home, so they're here. But yeah, this thing here, this is what I use to extend the range to this part of the house. So I have one on the, on this wing of the house. I have another one on the other wing of the house. So that's uh, that allows the whole house to be covered. So that's uh, yeah, that's basically it. This is this is my office. Uh, if you add up the cost of just the computer equipment in here, the desk, the notebooks, the the drives, scanner, printer, shredder, and all the camera gears, you're looking at over thirty thousand dollars. So this is a it's thirty thousand bucks. Yeah, it's um, a little a little high for an office, but hey, you know when you live the dot com lifestyle, you can afford to do this kind of stuff. All right. So anyway, so I hope you enjoyed this little tour. Uh, give me a thumbs up if you like it. Uh, like and share my video. Subscribe to my channel. And I'll see you guys on the next episode.